Hey guys, uh, this is Srikant, Java Full Stack Trainer in Wikip Software Solutions. So in the last class, we covered like um, uh, explain default method with real-time example programs. Now we are going to discuss explain static method with real-time example program. You know, guys, uh, static method, yeah, we know static method in our regular classes, but here we are going to discuss explain static method in interfaces, I can say, okay? So static methods in interfaces were introduced in Java 8. Why they introduced? Because you can say to provide utility methods directly associated with the interfaces. So utility method means like uh, to provide constant behavior for all the classes instead of creating any additional classes or any additional information. So let's say if client is giving some requirement to developers, instead of providing all the information in all the classes again and again repeatedly so if you maintain a utility method in interface which will be applicable for all the classes we can say that is way to provide constant behavior from the now for the classes we need a static methods in interfaces you know static methods in interfaces cannot be overridden by implementing classes and providing level of security and ensuring consistent behavior. Yes, of course, these methods we cannot override as we know one of the rule from method overriding static methods we cannot override by implementing classes. So here, the static method is default behavior which is providing from the client. So, you know, but difference between default methods and static methods in interfaces default methods later if you have any uh, you if you don't want to continue with the same behavior you cannot change but here it's a consistent behavior for all the classes so that is what the second point we are discussing java interface static method helps us in providing security by not allowing the implementation classes to override them so you know you, you understood the both points yeah it's almost similar to provide security we are using these uh, static methods in interfaces. In interfaces can have static methods. Since main method is just a static method is allowed to. So some people were asking like uh, in interfaces, can we have static main methods? Yes, of course, we can have static main methods. Since main method is static, it's allowed to in interfaces. Static methods we cannot call by using reference variable. We must need to call with the class name in your regular process. But here you can keep uh, with the interface name, you can say. If you want to use static methods, you, you will be going to use the, you will be going to use with the interface name. Now you will see the example, which I already discussed one of the example, which is related to static. Here we will be going to write a function in interface like let's say here I'm going to make static void some display is the method I'm going to create. So here I'm going to provide a behavior system dot of dot print and off bank info bank info. I'm just writing some information method. This text is not a matter for you. So here we just used bank info. But can we can we write uh, display as a static? Yes. If we remove static, it is an instance. But instance methods are not allowed in interface. So now I'm going to keep here. It's a static. So static white display. Now in the test bank, if you remember, yes. Can I call SA dot display answer is no okay so because here if you try to create a dot display it will say boss that static method of interface bank can only be accessed bank dot display so never and ever we will be not going to call interface static method by using reference variables here you can keep like this yes the static method of interface bank can only be accessed as bank.display. If you want to call what we need to do, you must need to comment the above one 
and I'm going to use bank dot display. Okay, so let's run this code. Then yeah, whatever I mentioned, the message. So bank info. So that is coming from the bank enterprise. So if you want to try, if you want to try salary account implement bank, if you want to try to override display is a method. If you are trying to override like wide, let's keep it as a public. So let's move it like, sir, we created, right? But no, whenever you mention it, that it override, it will say there is no display method in a parent interface. How can I call like that? You will see. So let's make it is here also study. Then it is going to say, so the method display of type salary account must override or implement super type methods. So this one is also not possible, you can say, okay. So this is what to provide consistent behavior for all the classes. Let's say this is your driver class. In driver class, you can call bank dot display. Here, here also you can call bank dot display. Yes, in the two places, you will say bank info, bank info. Then what is the difference between default methods versus static methods? Where default methods we can override and it is providing a default behavior for all the classes. Whereas this one is related to consistent behavior and you can say for security, some of the functionalities which we cannot override in from the classes, then we can go for this static method. And the last point, yes, in, in, in interfaces, can we have a main method? Yes, we can have a main method from 1.8 downwards in interfaces. We can have main method is the message I'm writing. Let's run the code. Interfaces can I run? Yes, if you run it will open, it will print. Only in interfaces we can have main method which is main method, right? So yes guys, this is what interface default methods, abstract methods, static methods. And you know, from 1.9 onwards, we have a private methods private methods, let's say I'm going to take it as a method one. So to avoid duplication, to avoid, so let's say here I'm going to say hello, hello method one. And of course, you know, private methods, we cannot access outside of the classes, private methods, we cannot access in inheritance also. So private method, then what is the purpose of this private method means? Whenever you want to avoid some duplicate functionalities from default methods then you can go and uh, use this private methods only to avoid duplication code from default methods we introduced private methods so whereas private methods we cannot override and we cannot use it as well okay so this is what if you can run this code you can see this is where in interfaces we can have main method uh, main method private methods, static methods, default methods as well. Of course, previously you have abstract methods and by default public static. Okay, so by default st public static, you can say variable like any variable, you can take string some name equals to bank. You can say BQ bank. Okay, so if you want to give this name or you can say this name somewhere like it's a bank name if I want to provide VQ bank like this variable you cannot change later. So this is given by the clients whenever the client is looking for our data should not be changing in future then we can go and keep those variables inside the interfaces. In interfaces all variables are public static all methods are public abstract these two you can say up to 1.7 from 1.8 onwards yes we have default methods of course it is also by default public you have display like a static method this is also public all methods from interfaces are public okay so this is what about your small concept static methods from interfaces thank you done for the day